going to try some cookies from this place in New York called Levain. Can't really see it. Levain Bakery. I lived in New York City for three years. Apparently, I'm an idiot because I never tried this place. But I can't confirm that until I actually eat the cookies and decide if they're any good. Stand by. The first cookie we're going to try is oatmeal raisin. Fresh out of the oven. It's pretty warm. Woo! Fingers are burnt. A lot of people have issues with oatmeal raisin cookies. I'm not one of those people unless somebody tries to present them as chocolate chip cookies and then they end up being oatmeal raisin cookies. I like both. I mean, obviously, chocolate chip is superior, but I can eat oatmeal raisin. No big deal. Taylor, who sent me these cookies, she said that I needed to rank them. But I'm not sure if I'm going to eat all four of them. I'll just have to rely on my memory. My amazing memory and recall action. Okay. Oui. My wife ate half of this cookie already. Look at this cookie. It's like, it's like a muffin. It's so thick. Woo, pretty warm. Woo, oh man. The inside is like gooey. That's a good, that's good. That's a good cookie. I think I, I was actually gonna do a workout, but I'm really tempted to get a glass of milk. I don't wanna get a glass of milk right before I work out though. Okay, so we're off to a great start. What is the place called again? Levine. Le Levine. Levine Bakery, your oatmeal cookie, oatmeal raisin cookie is excellent. Oh yeah, like the middle, I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but it's good. It's really good. Woo. What did you do? What did you do with the box? I just put it where you left it. Oh, okay. So the other flavors, when we get around to them, are uh, where did the? Nope, not that. Oh, the other options are. Chocolate chip walnut, dark choco choco, and dark choco peanut butter. So later we'll be trying the three that are not oatmeal raisin. Based off of the oatmeal raisin, which I think most people would assume is the least good cookie. I, I would like to think that the rest of them are good cookies. Because the oatmeal raisin is legit. Okay, we're going to try another one of these cookies. Look at the size of these things. They're huge. Uh, I haven't decided which one we're gonna try next. I'm still trying to decide. Dark Choco Choco. Warm up in the oven. If you're gonna warm your cookies up in the oven, don't be a dumbass like me and handle them without a spatula. I just got burnt hot chocolate all over my fingers and then my cookie broke in half. Genius move. Okay, we're gonna try dark choco choco. You can see the, looks like the middle of this one's a little chewy too. Okay. Let's try. Let's try the dark choco choco. Mm. 
just kind of crumbling everywhere. Kind of reminds me of a brownie. It's pretty good though. You can see like, maybe you can see, but there's like melted chocolate chips or like milk chocolate within the dark chocolate in the middle feels very cake like wow so good oh yeah that's super good i don't know i don't know which one's better that's pretty hard it's pretty hard comparison between this and the oatmeal. I have to think it over. This cookie kind of have has an unfair advantage in that I have a glass of milk this time because I'm not about to work out since I already worked out. But I think I might have to give the advantage to the Choco Choco Dark. This is really good. Okay, it's the next day of eating cookies. This next one is chocolate chip walnut. Look how big this cookie is. It looks really good. Let's see if it tastes really good. I don't need to take a second bite to say that this is the best one so far. This is a really good cookie. And like the other two, it's like perfectly sm smushy and soft in the middle. Good job, Levain, Levine, Levain, Levain Bakery. Your cookies are pretty good. Yep. Wouldn't be able to keep these in the house. They wouldn't last very long. I would get super fat. Okay. We're on the last cookie. This one is chocolate, chocolate peanut butter, I think. Take a look. You can see the inside. Looks like there's some peanut butter chips. See how this one compares to the others. It looks really good. It smells really good too. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's really good. Oh my God. That was like surprising, like shockingly good. Um, like, I don't know, I love peanut butter, but to me, peanut butter flavored things, sometimes they're just okay. But the exceptions are lovely, like this. Oh my God. It's starting to fall apart. <clears throat> It's so good. Yeah. I was really tough between that one and the chocolate chip walnut. I don't know. I gotta go. Oh, it's really hard. I mean, I guess I can have a tie. Wow, oh, they're all really good. I, I don't know. 
I, I think I gotta go with the uh, the peanut butter, chocolate chocolate peanut butter as the probably number one because it's so surprising. Followed by the chocolate um, chip walnut and um, what was the third one? Was it chocolate chocolate? That was really good too. I mean the the oatmeal raisin was super good and I feel like it would so obviously in most cases be like the bottom of the pack but I feel like this is a case where it's like number four out of four but I would highly recommend it like oh, there's all of them are good these are these cookies are so good thank you Taylor and uh if you're ever in New York or DC or wherever they have the bakery, Levine, Levine, I'll look at the box. Definitely check it out. I can't believe I never had these cookies until now. Amazing.